Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Microsoft Edge um, comes bundled by default with both Windows 10 and Windows 11, as many of you would know. And because of this, um, in case you were unaware, it actually, to some extent or the other, um, loads into memory using a feature called Startup Boost, which actually means the browser um, will load to some extent or the other um, in the background when you boot up your Windows 10 and Windows 11 device. Now, um, in case you're unaware what Startup Boost is all about, um, Microsoft's uh, definition of Startup Boost is that it improves uh, the startup speed of Microsoft Edge and keeps the browser running in the background with minimal processes, so Microsoft Edge will start more quickly when launched. Now, um, if you are using Microsoft Edge um, as your default web browser or regularly, obviously this feature will be of benefit. But as an example, if you are not using Edge as a default browser, say you are using Chrome um, as a default web browser, then obviously um, having Microsoft Edge um, start up um, in the background every time you boot up your operating system would not be of benefit because um, it means it's uh, using more system resources, which means that um, if you do disable the startup boost, if you're not using Edge as your default browser, um, it can uh, cause your PC to start up um, slightly faster. And also, um, it frees up memory because it's not loading those processes into memory and in the background. So if you free up memory, it means you give your system more resources so to some extent or the other you will actually boost and speed up your pc to some extent now before we have a look at how you can turn off startup boost what i would suggest first of all um, in both operating systems is head over to your settings and then navigate to your apps page and on your apps page head to your startup apps and i would suggest turning off microsoft edge if it is listed as an entry in your startup apps so as an example, if Microsoft Edge is listed, turn off um, Microsoft Edge. And I have actually posted a whole video on how you can configure your startup apps. And I'll leave a link down below to that video. So turn um, Microsoft Edge off. That's your first point of call. And then um, getting back to Startup Boost. Um, for this, we head back to the browser and we navigate to the top right to the menu. Click on that. Click on Settings. And then head over to the system and performance page. And yeah, at the top, you'll see that the setting startup boost and the description reads, get to browsing quickly. When this is on, it helps Microsoft Edge open faster when you start your device. And um, this is turned and toggled on by default, um, by the way. So um, we have to turn that off. And then obviously that disables and um, turns off startup boost, which means then that that will stop Edge from automatically loading on Windows Startup, thereby freeing up system resources. And um, with your uh, Startup apps configured and you've turned off Microsoft Edge in your Startup apps and obviously turning off this setting um, will mean then that obviously you free up, you know, it won't be a, a great deal and a great amount, but you will to some extent free up some system resources and then to some extent you'll be able to boost and speed up your PC. And then something else you can try is also turn off this setting. Continue running background extensions and apps when Microsoft Edge is closed, just on a side note. And I actually have posted a whole video on how you can do that in both Windows, I'm um, sorry, in um, Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge. And I'll leave a link down below to that video if that would be of interest. So that's just a quick way how you can stop Edge from automatically loading um, in the background into memory on a Windows startup if you are using um, Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.